Tom Houston was our president, Billy Allen was, was our past president, and Al Carroll uh, was uh, the person who, who followed me. And uh, Al was the person, he was a banker, uh, Tom had banking experience, and so they did all that uh, stuff in terms of the financing. Uh, I just had had uh, the vision. But uh, Mr. Mr. Hester strongly believed uh, that uh, the Dallas Black Chamber of Commerce continued to be needed. And some people say even today, do we really need a Dallas Black Chamber of Commerce? And I say, yes, as long as we don't have black people in those areas where decisions are made say it. that are critical to our lives, then we have to have a Dallas Black Chamber of Commerce. So we need the Black, the Dallas Black Chamber of Commerce today as, as much as, as, we, as we ever did. And uh, in my mind, uh, a Chamber of Commerce has always had two real duties and everything else you know kind of comes under that one is to promote black businesses and part of that is is creating the kind of environment that will allow them to grow and the second is to build leadership to develop leaders and i think there's no question in my mind that uh, the chamber has done over the years uh, a great job in those two areas. Everything else that the chamber does really comes, uh, in my mind, under those two categories. Okay. Without the Black Chamber of Commerce, I, I might not have served on the City Plan Commission. Mm -hmm. I might not have served on the Dallas County Grand Jury. Mm -hmm. I might not have served as Vice Chair of the Transit Board. I might not have served on the Executive Committee of the Red Cross or the Executive Committee of Goodwill. I might not have become a state representative and serving for 26 years at one time representing this area. Mm -hmm. I might not have a very successful business uh, over 30 years at Dallas uh, Fort Worth Airport and Love, and Love Field. Let us not forget that we stand on the shoulders of giants. And now it is our turn to continue to provide those shoulders and become those giants that others will <clears throat> be able to stand on the shoulders of. Mm -hmm. We must keep the legacy. We must be the keepers of the legacy. So I'm looking forward to all of the innovative, creative things that this chamber is going to do in terms of promoting black businesses and developing leaders. Thank yeah. you.